at News Magazine YouTube channel, mostly we post these topics. 1. Shocking News 2. Entertainment 3. How To 4. Popular Stories So don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, this man raped his friend's baby until she died. Now people want him to be publicly hanged for IT. After a man raped his friend's nine-month-old daughter until she died, a petition has been started to have him publicly hanged. Keep reading to learn more. After a man sexually assaulted his girlfriend's nine-month-old baby until she died, strangers from all over the country have started a petition to have him hanged. According to WCHS, 32-year-old Benjamin Taylor was found Monday morning in the basement of an apartment he shared with his girlfriend, the baby's mother. Amanda Atkins told police she woke up and realized her daughter, M. Ailey, was missing from her crib. According to Fox 43, after searching around the apartment, Atkins finally found M. Ailey unconscious and bleeding in the basement of their complex. Authorities say Taylor abused and raped the baby girl so viciously that she was already brain dead by the time paramedics arrived. According to West Virginia Metro News, Amelia's family ultimately had to make the heartbreaking decision to take their baby girl off life support. She passed away from her injuries immediately. Immediately, since news of the horrific story broke, Taylor's Facebook page has been flooded with hateful posts and comments from disgusted people all over the world. On Tuesday, a petition was started for the public hanging of Taylor, even though the death penalty has already been outlawed in West Virginia. The description on the petition reads, On October 4, 2016, it was reported that Benjamin Taylor, of Cottageville WV, sexually assaulted a nine-month-old baby girl. As of the time of this petition's creation, the baby was pronounced brain-dead as a result. Prison is too good for child rapists and their ilk. I would move to say that our justice system is even a part of the problem, and that incarceration is hardly justice when it comes to such an awful act. Maybe if these people were actually afraid of what would happen to them if, when they were caught, they'd be less likely to do such vile things. When it's an open and shut case such as this, let us hang these creatures publicly. Let us make examples of them and allow the American people to attend these hangings so that the accused may be ridiculed, as they should be. As of Thursday morning, the petition has been signed by nearly 2,500 people. Thanks.